Hey folks, how you doing? Welcome back. It's Charlie. It is... Say bye bye to November. The last day. Oh my god, this... Oh, this entire month went by so quickly. So quickly. A lot quicker than, than October for me. October seemed to drag. But this month... I woke up and it's like, it's almost over. It's just about... Just as well. But yeah, anyway, actually, it was it's cold last night, very, very cold, Ugh, bone chilling cold. Um, but the daytime's been beautiful. It's about three days now that it's three or four days, it's been very cold at night. But the days are just spectacularly beautiful, awesome. I am wearing a nice long sleeve black shirt because today I had my uh, I had a job interview today, the first time. In very long time maybe I shouldn't jinx myself I shouldn't be telling you this I thought about it but I just wanted to share that because you guys are vicariously well, I wouldn't say vicariously but obviously you're subscribed to me so you want to know what's going on so I'm telling you what's going on I had my first interview in a very very long time and this old fart was just I was at a loss of words. I didn't know. Honestly, I really didn't know how to act or what to say. And I felt kind of ashamed. I felt dumbfounded, out of place. But it it did, you know, it did seem to go well. Um, the main person that was supposed to interview me um, was not in. So he had a sub. Um, and I felt, you know, when you got that inner gut feeling when something goes okay or if it doesn't, it seemed to go pretty well. So hopefully, um, oh, God willing, please, fingers, toes, eyes, everything crossed, everything crossed. Hopefully it'll go well. Um, he said that he would forward his notes to the main person and uh, maybe in a couple days I should be getting a phone call from him hopefully to schedule uh, another second interview and uh, you know kind of as it goes usually a second interview is uh, pretty good so it's not a great job but it's close by it's within walking distance and it's money it'll be it'll be it'll certainly be a lot of money a lot more money than what I'm getting from government assistance you know and uh, and I, would, I just want to get off that that crutch. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to have GR and EBT, but it's not, it's not progress, it's not helping me to progress anymore. It's just keeping my life stagnant. Kind of like when churches give homeless people a sandwich, instead of helping them get off the street or finding them housing, you're just prolonging them. You're just making their lifestyle stagnant. And that's essentially what's been going on so i feel pretty confident and actually when i got back to my computer i kind of felt that well i can explain this that hunger that yearning for i i just went back onto craigslist and scoured the job sites again and i want to do it again i want more you know but um this job definitely will pay a lot more than what i'm receiving right now uh, so if I get it, that's that's fantastic. That's super. If I don't, that's okay. It'll be a trial run, but I'm still now looking for 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 jobs and stuff. So I got that taste in my mouth. I got that hunger, that that taste of blood. Now, now I want more than ever. I want to get a job and, and be employed again, and I feel a little bit more confident about myself. No, no, no. I, I honestly, I feel, I feel fantastically confident about myself. I know I can do this. I, I know my weaknesses and my strengths, and uh, I can do this. But please, knock on wood, right? Um, say a little prayer for me. Uh, yeah, that was cool. Very cool. Very, very, very cool. So 
Anyway, guys, I um, let's see. I think that's about it. I just wanted to touch bases with you guys and let you know where I'm at uh, in life and where I'm at today. So hopefully everything will be okay. But I will keep you guys abreast of what's going on. And um, yeah. All right, my friends. You guys take care. I love you. You guys take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. <laughs> I'm kind of excited, so let me start over. Guys, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other, but always take care of yourselves first. You can't take care of someone else. You can't take care of yourself. Love one another. Trust one another. Be kind to each other. We're coming up in December now. Happy holidays. Good karma. Be nice to someone. You know? Don't take today for granted. Don't take any other, any other day thereafter for granted. Live for the moment. Pull your pants down and slide on the ice. And hey, my friends, I love you all. Take care. I will post this as soon as I can. And uh, hopefully, God willing, I'll see you tomorrow. And hopefully... Maybe Friday, maybe this weekend, I'll get a phone call. We'll see. But I will let you definitely, definitely know. Maybe this could be the my big change. Definitely a quicker change than winning the lottery. What am I saying? This would be the lottery for me to get a job. I love you all. Take care, and I will see you again, my friends. Bye-bye.